Welcome back. We have Angela from the zoo here with us for our weekly segment on Tame Tuesdays. And she brought in a special guest. This is Attila, an African bullfrog, right, from Sub-Saharan Africa. Yes, indeed. Tell us a little bit about Attila. Well, these guys are a pretty cool species, actually. They're one of the larger frogs. When they're fully grown, they can be about 11 inches, so dinner plate size. Um, so Attila is still growing. They're native to deserts. and, and You said they eat them there. They, well, yes, what they do, they can't survive the dry season out in the open. Mm -hmm. So when the rains disappear, they actually bury themselves in the ground. They make a cocoon, basically of dead skin and, and slimy layers. Uh -huh. They bury themselves into the ground and that retains all their moisture in their body. They can stay underground for over a year at a time before the rain starts. So people in the desert have adapted um, to sometimes dig up the frogs to survive like a drought. Uh, they can no. basically use the moisture in their bodies. But so you could be We don't food. tell that to Attila. Oh. Okay, please, please, please tell him. <laughs> you, you're lucky you're here. Otherwise, you might be, you might be food for them. That's, That's a huge frog. Well, and, the, and, and we eat what? Uh, Frog legs? Sure. Oh, Different American kind of frog, frog right? Right. American bullfrog. This one's the African bullfrog. Okay. His legs are, comparatively are not as big and not as strong as like the American okay. bullfrogs. Um, they're smaller frog. They jump a lot further, a lot faster. Mm -hmm. These guys are so big. They can pretty much eat anything they want to. Anything that can fit in their mouth. Um, they're, they're a very vicious predator. What's oh, the biggest thing really? it could eat? How big? Any, well, if you look at his mouth, I mean, literally anything he can stuff in his mouth. So they'll eat birds. They'll eat oh other frogs. Oh, wow. They'll eat lizards, snakes. I didn't know that. And other he fish. weighs two pounds, you said. Yes. I don't know his exact weight. I haven't weighed him um, myself in a while, but, but he's <laughs> about, two, about pounds. two pounds. Yep, He's, he's a pretty huge. hefty guy, and like I said, he's still growing. And you guys have an event going on. Zoo Snooze programs are starting at the new zoo. They include live animal encounters, fun games and activities, and a moonlight safari through the zoo, a bedtime snack, and a light continental breakfast the next morning. Weekend Snoozes, a Friday and Saturday night package is $450 for up to 15 people. That sounds so cool. Mm -hmm. And weekday snoozes, Monday through Thursday nights, for hundred dollars for up to 15 people and special weekday school group snoozes are 325 for up to 15 people for more information or to book a zoo snooze program call 920-434-7831 that extension 2405 and your email address is uh, bc underscore zoo underscore education that's a mouthful <laughs> i recommend yes. just calling and you want to <laughs> come write it down we have it but we'll be right back look at him he's so big <laughs> 